What's up guys, it's Burn back here, and we're going back into some more Lay the Spire Library of Runa. So, earlier we played the Watcher. Earlier as in two days ago for you guys, for me it's been about two hours. I'm going to do a little bit of extra recording um, because I will be out of town for the weekend for Labor Day. Did have to think about it. But we're going in. I'm excited. A little bit of ironclad action here. We got 314 little uh, PE. I don't remember what they stand for, but we're going to go after the white. We did beat them last time and we're going to, I'm going to drink this stinking thing. Uh, I want the rabbit team. Give me those buns. We have the, the monetary value. I'm casting bunnies. I don't know if that's the phrase you would use. That might be inappropriate in some people's mind, but that's how I said it. And that's where we're going. I'm feeling pretty hyper. I've had dinner now. I'm like a normal human being again. I've unwound from work. Uh, I felt a little crabby earlier, as in we got our butt kicked and I could do nothing about it. I'm gonna play bash there. One defend, one bash. But I'm, I'm not letting it get me down. Uh, the, I won't let the game win this time. Two strength on this bush. Bush is going down here though. Um, actually, it won't. Go with the bash. Bunny time? No. Too early. Be a waste of the buns. And they're super powerful might. Now, I'm going to be really sad if these bunnies are anticlimactic. Because um, in my brain, I'm working really hard for them. So, we are going to go and start trying to actually combine and use cards more efficiently. Um, I think we've not seen all of Spider Bud. So let's grab that, actually. Um, extra draw is great. Metallicize is also very good. I want to unlock spider bud. Hey bud. Oh no we did. This is just a draw engine card. I actually don't like this card. That's the card on top of your deck. Yep. Because I still don't understand how it works. Because it exhausted more and more cards. I will probably remove that one. Uh 50 50 face. Bad face. Of course. Not weak in this face so I won't be too sad about it. But it is not good face. Uh, we'll go with the defend and the strike here. But I hope everyone's going good. It is Wednesday, which it felt very much. Maybe it already drew it and it already exhausted it. Yeah, playing it just exhausts the card. Okay. I think I understand this card more. So it automatically draws the card. When we play it, exhaust another card at the top of my de our deck, and then we'll and then we'll play. We'll draw additional cards. Yeah, so that's how it works. So you start by exhausting the card, and then pr it progressively gives you more card draw. I should attack again. Um, as you do it, yeah, because that drew two more cards. Here's our five. There's the two it drew. So pretty much you can. Uh, Make a more, I guess it's a more variable card drawing system by exhausting more cards. And actually thinking about it, that actually might be pretty good because we are the Ironclad and he can benefit from exhausted cards. So I'm excited to see where that goes. Let's apply vulnerability. We're going to go for the kill here. We did. Oh, new cards. Scale tilted according to the sins committed. Let's go with this one. And we'll go ahead and get a full unlock on that thing. Her deck. Uh, I actually feel like we get a lot of value by putting Spider Bud back on the deck. Um, okay. Enemies lose 10% of its max HP to a minimum of 9. Uh, enemy loses. Okay. Uncontrolled. Exhaust all status and curse cards in your hand. Okay. Time a card is exhausted by this card's effect. Okay. Interesting. Uncon and when is uncontrollable go off? When drawn. Okay. I'm actually okay with that. I'll take the damage. We can heal through that, I think. Be confident. Okay. Continue along here. Ooh, early line shop. I wasn't expecting this actually. Um, I want cards that benefit with exhaust. 
Look great each time you lose HP while this card is in your Eh, not very excited for that right now. I think I'll save my money for the next shop. Okay, we did we did lose some money for Bun. Bun uh code bunny is not right. So this should be 10 damage. 9 damage. Do a minimum of 9. Okay. Do that. We'll put that back on top because it's a it's a, pretty much a one for nine, if not more. Okay with. Um, Firebug, go ahead and exhaust. Ooh, we got the bash that time. As good. Let's go ahead and block two. And it's based on max HT, so it's going to be better against bosses here than against normal enemy, which is unfortunate. I feel like the normal enemy fights are harder. So having like more for them would be better, but at the same time it is okay. And every card gains a gift. What was you? What were you again? When the gift, it costs a card. Used by one. And then if this card is not in your hand, playing a card with gift or exhausted, dealing sixty. I don't think I want that. Um, let's take the new card. And then we will take a shrug. Shrug is fine. Also, I could have took the wild strike and exhausted the wounds. All cards gain retain, gain one retain. Okay, I can't unlock anymore. We'll have to see as we go. I don't know if I'm excited or not excited about that. Metallicize for four is pretty good. Okay with that. Uh, let's. Get the regret. We're going to a shop. Give me the regret. See if I hate it or not. Well, with a fight here. Definitely don't really like it. Okay. That should retain, right? This also retains, though. Interesting. Um. So double this. Fighter Bud. Judgment. Oh, okay. Uh, headbutt. Put back the bud. Bash. Ended up not mattering too much. Uh, let's wait here. I got a couple I need to finish off anyway. Uh, none of those are necessary. Okay. When this car exhausts, gain five strength, become cursed. Parasite. Huh. Is it we gain one parasite every t okay? Oh, we get the parasite now because we have it, but we can use that officially, and it fits into our exhaust deck. And give up that. Get rid of the regret. Anything else here? Ooh, apotheosis is pretty good. All right, let's get rid of the regret. It's the worst one. Um, uh, whenever you shuffle, no, no. Sundial is pretty good, but. Your deck's a little too big for that currently. Um, I'll just take the copy of Apotheosis and continue my day. Go for this Emerald Elite here. No AOE, which kind of sucks here. Um, let's get the big guy down. Get him out. I guess he had the least curl up, so in retrospect, some of the other ones might be consider considerably more powerful. Ooh, gross. Bad turn. Um, headbutt you, I guess. Give me back the shrug to the top. I can't kill them, so... We're just gonna take a lot of damage here. And not a lot, but a fair amount. Uh, nine... Six, and six. Could've been worse. Oh, actually. Grab another card and let's unlock them all. I still am looking for more exhaust cards. You want to exhaust Snow White with the apple. Carve this card. And we can't look at it. Uncontrollable. Uh, look at these. Yeah. Continue along here. Emerald Elite. Ugh. Definitely other ones I probably would have rather had. But that's fine. I still don't have a good payoff, unfortunately. For the card draw that we have. Wish I could see it. 
the potential card draw, I guess, technically. Alright, Palisize. Hit you for nine, I guess. Frog. That's fine. And I guess we can Headbutt and Spider Bud to selectively exhaust cards we don't want to see in our deck. Pretty interesting little concept there. Alright. We got our setup done. Let's see if we can actually do something with the 18 apple not great no block cards and also oh huh. weird i don't know why that happened but i guess it did technically we have four cards I don't know why they're all exhausting. Probably that new card I picked up. We have five strength because of that, but I guess our deck is now two cards. You're dead. Let's see if we can actually get out of this. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. We did about die though. Um, the car wouldn't. Uh, no. I don't think I want either one of those. I'm going to skip right here. I need to figure out what our card's doing. Is it vulnerable? That's fine. Um, exhaust one card. That will help. Okay, you... Discard this card. Sure. It's drawn within three turns of discarding it. Okay, but it exhausts the whole deck. There's something... About I don't have enough, again... But there's something with it exhausting my whole deck. Oh, White Dawn request this time. Alright, and this is a new one. This is Black Fixer. We've seen White Fixer. There's Black Fixer. Strike. And we'll headbutt the strike back to the top. We're also going to go ahead and throw this on you. And I'm going to go ahead and drink this. Because it's going to be a bad, bad combat. Ow. Okay, defend here. Get two strikes on you. I'm waiting. Yep, big attack here. Oh, uh, the same turn as the Apotheosis, too. Spider Bud. We exhausted a Parasite. I didn't know we had another Parasite in here, which is concerning. Um, 13, 17, 24. Okay. Um, we're going to take some here. Ow. Three, four. I think I like the last one better. Okay. Not too bad. 16 more. Ow. Through grit. We did something randomly. Not what I wanted. Ooh, that's not good. Oh, actually, we're blocked. Headbutt back the true grit. Okay. We actually discarded everything that time. Weirdly enough. And we did 20 damage that time. Slightly confused, but we'll figure it out. Um, those are all fine. Go ahead and exhaust the strike. Mm, I need to keep Shrug. Build this damage. We're actually blocked, so let's kiss more. Music pretty intense here. There's the Apotheosis on the big damage turn. Yeesh. Alright, get that out of here. Defend again. I mean, I think we might still be dead. I think not getting the Apotheosis out so early. We, or we might be alive just barely. I, I didn't do the math. 15, I think we're down like 3. Nope, 7. I tried doing the, the counting at the very end. 25 for some reason. Okay. I'm gonna make a risky move here. Yep. Did end up paying off, I think in here. Oh, I want those cards, so. We'll save Spider Bud. Take one, but we got everything upgraded now. Good part. Okay. Eight coming in, so. Hit you, shrug. Hit you again. Alright, I think we got this. Assuming nothing, like, randomly kills me. There's a Lorium. Alright, there we go. Just barely. Skin of our teeth, but we got it. I can't see. 
Uh, me or no bracelet or prayer. Let's do the bracelet. Raise your max HP by 15 whenever you lose HP gain one regen. If you do not lose any HP for six turns, lose 10 max HP. Oh. Okay. That's weird. What do you do again? You hurt me, don't you? What do you do? No, that one does 20 damage to me. You deal 50. I don't want that. That killed me last time, I'm pretty sure. Vitalis says, I need something. Okay. I know what we're, our, our, our test is. I gotta watch because it's every six turns I don't take damage. Atheosis, metallicized, go. Okay, we're hurt. Ow. Are we exhausting the stupid? Yes. I don't know what's exhausting, I don't remember. There's a card we have that exhausts curses when we draw them. I don't remember what it at is, but that's doing damage to us. Oh, and 25 here. That's gross. You lose 12. That's fine. There we go. We have 21 here. So take four in another one region. Parasites. How many? How much of our decks parasites? We have three of them currently. 10 damage here. We're not dead, but we will be in a bad space. Okay. Oh, two region that time. Palisades, we're not taking damage now, but we are not doing very good. I am not doing good. Okay. Keep it going. 10 damage. Um, go ahead and drug here. What's our discard? Most stuff. A lot of coins though. Got the parasite. Okay. Oh, we're fully blocked, so let's get some more damage in here. Fine. Alright, and then ow. Again, I don't these are considered statuses. And something we have exhaust statuses here. Fortunately, I need a block for some hit him. Okay. I mean, assuming we don't die here from exhausting something randomly, which we didn't, we will make it out of this fight. Lumified hand is good. So we can do with it. Um, I'm going to skip again. I need to figure out what our cards our cards do currently. Uh, it's you, I think. Otherwise, exhaust all cards within three turns of discarding it. Otherwise, oh, we need to draw this a bunch of times. And what is giving us these stupid parasites? It's you, right? I'll have to become cursed parasite. No. He's also status and curses. This five AG each time one is exhausted. That's it. That's the problem child here. Okay, we need a rest. I need to get rid of that, the bird one. I'll take the parasites, apparently. And it's whatever, really, to me. Frog. Uh, that's fine. If anything, I just need to make it through this combat. Something slothful, I guess. They're asleep. Allow me to set up. Okay, hit you. Regret, that's fine. Uh, random relic, sure. Okay. Hell size, headbutt. Give me back the bash, I guess. And hit you a couple times. 12 here, I'll take five. Which is fine, that resets our bracelet. Oh, actually it doesn't, because they actually don't hit me. Okay. Uh, Apotheosis here. Defend. So we're gonna take some damage, but also our bracelet won't deal a bunch of damage to us. Heal 10. Perfect. Okay. Started that. Okay. This is actually a, a ton of damage on her because it's 10% of max. However, you're the one who needs to die. We are gonna true grid out a parasite here. I'm gonna hit you again. Taking 20 here. 
I don't know we're not. We're taking four. Metallicize is just really good. Um, let's do stupid daze is. Okay. And we're going to hit you again. And then we're going to get the slime out. I'm, I'm surprised the log of Ulan here did not uh, end up being worse for us. I guess slimes. Be what? One big one? Yep. Okay, what do we have? 26. Oh, I don't want to exhaust the headbutt, unfortunately. Well, I guess I could do this. Oh, I got the slime. Cool. Um, you need to go away. And then we'll take two here. Well, it's actually going to be her switching. Uh, take 27. Five bites, sure. All right. Man, our deck is full of nonsense. Um, I mean, let's heal up. Why not do a bunch of damage right here? 25 coming in. Oh, I should have flexed. Huh? Let's exhaust this bite. We're going to take 25. Oh, all of our cards just exhausted. Very nice. I think our deck is mostly bites right now. Yeah, it's like the same, like, five cards. Nice, two of which are slimes. Um, let's get our, our hand situated. Defend here, and then we'll call it. Lick me. That's fine. Continue. Add the two wounds. It's fine. Our hand isn't very great either way, so... But we're down to, like, the same, like, few cards. And then we'll interrupt. Throw the bite back on top. Okay, they're split. Take 18, I guess. Ow. Okay. Bite, headbutt, defend, and then cheese retreating. Whew, that was a rough one. That was a rough one indeed. But, uh, so these are invisible cards apparently, which now I have. Yep, I can see it now. Isaac can be given is caution aware of your surroundings. Dimensional or refraction variant. Whenever this card exhausts, gain two intangible. The downside. Whenever this card is played, deal 14 damage to yourself. And you can't see it. Weird. Okay. Uh, I think I'll want impervious. And, oh. At the start of your turn... He's gonna put a card from your draw pile into your hand. Three turns. No. No longer Smith. That actually works because we have Apotheosis. I have. Or I see no problem with that. Our deck is such a jumble. We really need something to take advantage of parasites because we have a thousand of them. Okay. Up this way, up this way. We need some more exhaust, honestly. We have 300, so this early shop actually is pretty nice. Leads, bonfire, bunch of rest, actually. Let's, let's do that. Oh, oh, of course. Nice opening hand. All right, and I do, I do really need a card removal. That's one of the reasons I'm like super gung ho to hit the shop really quick. Because there's plenty of cards we could use that are going to make our deck much better. You for nine. Bash you. Strike you. They're dead next turn. Okay. Oh, they're both leaving right now. And we didn't get a single attack. Um, I mean, I'll do this just to see if it works. Put back. This card. Yeah, we didn't kill them. Uh, apotheosis, defend, metallicize, true grit, Doss this, spider button, and pride because they took he, they took your gold. <laughs> if it ends up mattering, then I'll be sad, but hopefully it doesn't. I, I don't want no more cards right this second. I, I want to save up for bunny blast. No, our deck's big enough as it is. 
Okay. Please do during your turn. Gain twice that much black. Okay. This is actually like really good together. Um, I think I'm going to take, because I can't get both these. King of Hearts, because I lose a lot of HP during my turn. Where are you? Get out of here, Bird of Judgment. You dealt so much damage to me. Because I could lose HP on my turn to do this. Oh, it's max HP though. That's going to be still rough. We're a trap. Uh, 38. Oh, we avoided it. Perfect. Boot. Pretty good. Pretty good. This arm's fine. I actually kind of enjoy that card. Uh, offering's also very good. Um, making our deck thicker is going to be kind of necessary. Our deck is like 40% Parasite right now. All size, defend, defend. Uh, there's the unplayable card, which it remind me, it's when I play it, right? And it's just a free one cost when it exhausts gaining it to intangibility. I have no way to exhaust it currently, so we will just let it stay in our hand. Now I'll leave a card between it so I can see. Oh, is it retained? Or does that just happen to be from like another card we have? Um, let's just play deal 14. Oh. So it's right here. Upgrade everything. Crew Grit. The intangible card. It is very hard to see, but I do like that interaction. It's like sneaky, but now that I understand it, that there can be invisible cards, um, I'm okay with it. Also, the... Um, the offerings works really well with the luminous bracelet. I'm pretty happy with that energy here. Okay, what do we have in here? Nothing that I care about, so go ahead. Spider Bud, do your thing. Hit you. Hit you. Drug. Draw. Hit you. Bash you. And we're good. And we got a little bit of uh, region. Look how many parasites are in my hand. This is super nuts. All right, hit them again. Uh, 12, I should have impervious, but I think I'll still take one, which is acceptable here. Honestly, almost preferred. Um, nope, still saving up for Bunny Boss. Our, our stuff really works very well together right now. Another shrug is good. We need to get through our deck very quickly. Ooh, White Noon. We got uh, the white fixer and then red fixer this time okay let's shrug we need to get to apotheosis pretty dang quickly um i know she does a pretty good amount of damage so let's lay into her first they might have abilities that don't show on their cards we also need to keep in mind her prayers because those uh are as you would call it, deadly uh, we're going to do this in a specific order here to get rid of that parasite or the intangible card, which we did. Pretty good. Buys us a couple turns. Problem is we don't have a lot of damage. We really need Apotheosis to come through for us. And this is not how you do that. No. Kind of sad here. Oh. Well, there's Apotheosis. Good turn to have it because there's Impervious. I think I'd rather actually go ahead though, because she's praying, I can't hurt her. Let's do this and then defend. We still get 12, which is, so we'll take two. Not actually that bad. And him doing less damage overall could end up mattering. Because he seems to do attacks in, uh, in sequentials. But an offerings here. Hand is full, that's fine. Bash her, strike her. Yeah, let's keep the damage rolling on this other one. Red Fixer seems kind of handled currently. And defend. 31. I guess I could have Spider Bud just to have exhausted another possibly dubious card, but we're fine here. Got that Sword Slash with the, the very nice animatics. Oh, 47 this turn. He does do other things. Um, there's a chance this could be good. Got a Parasite. Very nice. Um, we're going to play out the hand. 
be pinning her. Uh, still gonna take a fair bit here, but same time, it's only 12. Laser gun. So he seems like a bunch of little attacks and then finishes you off with a fairly big attack. She's praying, can't hit her. So we're gonna go actually start putting some damage in on him. Okay. Should have blocked once, but I, I missed it. Bash is always one of those cards that's like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm devoting a lot of effort to this card um, for just vulnerability, which is good in its own right. Okay. Shoot me with that machine gun, Halo. It does have a little bit of a longer time to play. Um, big attack here. Uh, I don't really want to do that. Let's go with the double shrug first. Both parasites. I really don't want to hit him pervious. We actually could just let's just continue with what we're doing. I don't need to play spider butt here. We're still fine. And she should be willing up for a big attack. So she's willing up for prayer here. Bash him and let's continue on the damage train then. We've we've gotten an equilibrium. Luckily they don't have a good amount of scaling on their side. Um, which for me is good because we are slow. Our deck is slow as molasses, actually. I'm trying to lay the damage in on the back line because everyone's got her killed. I feel like it'll be at least one more turn. Actually, we might fire pot next turn to finish her. Just to make it a little easy to get more damage on the front liner. Who's doing this big attack this turn? Did not get impervious, unfortunately. That does put a damper on my specific plans but i mean still only taking 12 and we get consistent region throughout so oh she's praying this time so i can't kill her if i wanted to there's the impervious let's just go ahead and burn that now since we know we are kind of out on the weeds on um that big attack we have a couple turns and i'm hopeful that we can kill red fixer before then Boom, let's go ahead and pot you. Go ahead and shrug. All right, guns left. I don't know if she can recover herself because it still has a tag for white fixer. Okay. Or that might just be her animatic when she's dead. Not quite sure on that one. Ooh, sword. I didn't even notice he had that red sword. Hit them here, 25 down. Okay. Big bash and striking her dead. Weapons to overcome. Uh, gain. It has a chance to reduce your max HP by. No, I do not need any more max HP L. Let's try this one. Flesh idol. Ugh. Yeah. Uh, at the end of your turn, deal two damage to yourself. Uh, at the first four turns, heal two HP after the fourth turn. The four HP from. Minotaur armor at the end of the 18th turn, you die. That's gross. So we can't, we gotta beat the beat before 18 turns. And we are too slow for that really right now. Uh, I might sell some stuff at the shop. Might be able to, oh, we can't smith. I came all this way for a smithage. That we cannot do. Um, we'll break off and go, no, it's still better to go this way. We'll, we'll go to this other elite then. All right, uh, Spider Bud, we need to be a, yeah more proactive right here. All right, and this is maybe you lose HP during your turn. Yep. Uh, okay, disarm this fool. Through grit the uh, disc because that gives me a bunch of strength. And yep, there we go. Our deck is like 900% parasites. We really need a way to take advantage of it. Okay. Tell size, defend, defend, drug. Def oh, headbutt there. Super defense. Okay. On four turn, we can't get to 18 offerings here. Into our block, metallicize. Go ahead and let's start dealing damage to my friend here. Get that bash back. Go ahead and defend again. 
There we go. We do have invisible card in our hand. We could use a true grit here. Really need to see. Nothing. But this is a very proactive turn. Okay. And the region is stacking pretty well. But I think Flesh Idol, I think, will be end up being our downfall. Oh, th that card is... Oh, no, nope, that card is still in our hand. Through Grit, this card. This invisible, invisible card. Um, and then we can deal more damage to you. And this is the end of the fight. We're heal we healed a little bit. Seven on an elite fight's not bad. The boss fights, I am a bit more worried about. This sucks. Oh, he's dead. He had already was vulnerable. I was like, this sucks. We won't be able to beat him. But ended up working out. This kind of works with what we're doing. We're not playing... We are playing skills, though. We gotta exhaust stuff. And I can't... I don't know if it's a debuff. Much more room. We can add a card to your deck. Points per room. That's fine. Bot weakness for strength. Makes us a little faster. I mean, that's kind of what we need right now. Fast, efficient fights. And then we're going to... Do that. No white's apple. Apotheosis. Disarm you. Headbutt. Give me back the bash to the top. Alright. Then we spot weakness. Bash. Go for me a shrug here. <laughs> so many parasites. Have I had some way to take advantage of them? Like my main downside right now. This, do this. I mean, go ahead and Spider Bud. Got the impervious. Now we don't need that big of a block though. Really, specifically. <laughs> Ridiculous. 35 card deck with what, like one card, like actually useful to us? Okay, they're dead. Defend. You have nine strength. I mean, we're making it work here. Okay, Orium does 20 damage. Spider Bud got the spot weakness here, which is fine. Parasite. I need something that's like exhausted card in return. Would be very good. Honestly. Give me meat lantern. It's probably gonna go on a parasite, is the is the thing. Yeah. Go, tiny chest is fine. Alrighty, we have 400 by the way. We can call Bunny Squad if we get low. I gotta remember that. I think what I also could really use is Bottle Tornado for the Apotheosis. We're really slow until that exact moment. Damage here, which will keep the ring from triggering, or the bracelet, bracer, or what it would be. Break you and. Toss that Parasite out. Because 1 in 37 cards is not a very high probability to see something. At least and again, though. Damage here. Give me back the Aurium, maybe? Still trying to figure that one out. Yep, and that deals 20 AoE. And really, we could use some more Headbutts. As we see that card, we can continue to hit Offering with the, the whatchamacallit. Alright, let's toss the Parasite. Can't extend, but that's fine. Not too worried about it. Um, double metallicize here is very good. Make impervious free. That's great. Hit you. Okay. Up to seven turns. All right. Uh, spot weakness. Rug. Oh, we have this card too. Go ahead and exhaust this. Go ahead and exhaust this. Okay. Eight, so we're doing some more healing. Uh, offering still has its nonsense. 19 to you. Alright, next turn. That card would be way less pertinent if it didn't do 50 damage. Um, whenever you card and block. It's when I take damage we end up. I'm not that great. Lose 5 HP whenever you do not block an enemy's attack. This card is exhausted, the blessing is removed. I don't think I need those though. Upgraded headbutt. Oh, whenever a card is exhausted. No. I want the headbutt more to continue cycling out Orium. 
and to keep adding advantage to my deck in place of the parasites. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Ow. Spot weakness. Headbutt. Put spot weakness back. Rug. Spot weakness. Um, let's go ahead and get an attack in here too. Okay. It was definitely a choice there, but I'm kind of okay with that. Lose three max HP. Oh, why is our max HP so high too? I feel like we're gaining max HP from something. I don't really know what though. Okay, there's the card we need to exhaust. Let me make sure not to play it. Ow, it does hurt. There went Aurium. Uh, disarming them is a very good. It's Spider Bite, which is not the worst thing. Making sure we didn't have any invisible cards in our deck. And we need to make sure we don't play stupid bug one for a parasite. Ash. Yeah, we're pretty potent. We're good here. Whenever you lose HP from an enemy's attack, lay half of it to the next turn. Okay. Uh, yep. yep, 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 yep. That's what I was looking for. Ooh, another fixer fight. Ooh, there's four fixers this time. I was not expecting so much fixation on me. Opening Apotheosis is insane. Really good. Okay, a lot of damage coming in the first turn. Impervious, very good here. Problem is, I don't know if I'll be able to. I don't know if I'll be able to win this one. Idol of Flesh might kill me. It really depends on what I can do here. For the draw. Okay, Orium is back in the deck. That's going to be a lot of my damage, I think. Which is weird to say, but I'm going to recycle that a lot. Okay. I'm waiting for the turn of all Parasites. Oh, yeah. Bunch of healing. Palisize, defend, strike. Uh, I guess... Hail fix are pretty bad too. This actually. Oh no, we're actually just dead right here. Yeah, there's no way. Super dead. Wow. Yeah, even half though. I mean, half of this will still kill me, is the problem. It's gonna delay it, but. We would have took 54 additional next turn. Wow. Fixer feast. I mean, that was rough. I knew the fixers were going to be hard, but... Dang. Guess you cannot have a uh, non-cohesive deck, but... Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 11 parasites. A quarter of our deck was parasites insane but that's a pretty cool one it showed some synergy i wish we could have got a relic to take advantage of the parasites if we could have gotten a um a duvu doll or a black blackstone periat that would have been awesome that showed so much synergy between cards we had cards that exhaust and like synergize very well with the ironclad it was cool a lot of fun there but i'm not going to start another one uh we're going to wrap it up here guys i hope you guys did enjoy if you did, please hit that like button. Uh, let me know you're enjoying. Um, thank you all for all the help you've been giving me down in the comments. Um, I know there's a lot I'm still catching on to, but um, every time you guys give me some hints and tricks, it's always nice. Um, if there's any combinations I should look for in terms of cards you want to see me play with, um, I think I've been playing around with a lot of similar cards, but we still are unlocking the pool. Um, got to use the bunnies. Um, We'll get him next time because we, well, we might not get it. We'll probably get a rock next time, but if we don't, we'll still see him. That would have probably been pure, the best time to use them though. Because I bet they would have assisted in taking out maybe one of the people. Maybe take, uh, taking out Pale Fixer. I'm not sure, but that's going to do it for this episode, guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.